Hello everyone and welcome back to Genie Crafts. In today's video, we are going to see how to create this viral light painting or a variation of the light box. So guys, let's get started. So the first thing that you need to do is uh, for this kind of light box is to have two sets of prints. Uh, one is the outline image which the person will see when there is no light turned on. So in this case, I have the outline image of the Iron Man. And then the second set of image is uh, the colored version of that image which is going to throw the colors when the light is turning on so the outline image you need to take on a thin paper preferably regular photocopy paper or print paper and the colored printout you have to take on a acetate sheet now one of the key things that you need to understand here is that the dimensions of the outline print and that of the colored print are to match exactly that means that if you overlay your papers on top of each other the images will overlap completely 100 percent a little bit of one percent here and there is okay but more or less the images should overlap otherwise the colors will not align with the outline image and this is the simplest form of light painting that we can make in subsequent videos i'll be showing more complex forms of light videos also now to assemble this we need the regular light box uh, shadow box here so i have the shadow box from ikea uh, place the outline image first upside down obviously and then place the acetate sheets now you can see here that i have used three acetate sheets here now the clarity of the color after you turn on the light depends upon two factors one how bright the light is and second how clear the printout is on the acetate sheet now normally when you take printout on an acetate sheet even from a professional uh, printing shop the colors are not that solid so to solidify the colors what i have done is that i have taken three printouts i tried with multiple combinations three is the one where the colors really uh, came out once i turned on the light now unfortunately i uh, kind of uh, you know threw away the inner frame of it so I have to do a little bit of solution here with the help of you know uh, sunboard sheet pieces so that the back of the frame can rest on this but otherwise uh, you can use the regular structures of any shadow box frame the lights I have assembled on the back closure of the frame the LED lights multi strip LED lights also one more thing I want to mention here is that uh, like I said the the outline print the the one which you see without the light has to be taken on a thin paper uh, maximum 100 gsm because for the first try i did it you know on a 220 gsm paper and i just couldn't see the colors that were coming from the back also i s did say that the intensity of the light will determine how bright the colors are coming after you turn on the light but if the light is too intense then you will start seeing those led you know uh, things right through the page itself which will not look good so you have to strike a balance between the intensity of the light and uh, that of the number of acetate sheets and when you turn on the light this is how your outline image transforms into a light painting so i hope you guys found this video useful and instructional and as per the tradition of my channel in the next video i will show you guys how to create the template for such kind of light painting uh, till then uh, stay tuned if you guys like the video then please don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with your friends also do subscribe to my channel for more and more videos on different forms of arts and i will see you guys very soon in my next video till then stay safe take care and bye bye